Greetings and salutations, everyone. It is AJ Melnick once again, in case you forgot my name or my face or you remembered one or the other. I don't know. I'm terrible with names. I'm barely adequate at faces, so I understand. I believe you. I bear no ill will. Ill, ill, ill. Lots of and jets of bullshit happening over here. God damn. All right. Anyway, I'm doing another musical theater cover, Shocker. It is from Godspell by Stephen Schwartz, because that is currently my favorite musical right now. Expect a lot of it. Specifically, Bless the Lord, because a bitch gets pretty gospel up in here. I'm, I'm exceptionally white at 3 a.m. in the morning, <laughs> especially after a closing shift. I didn't realize I was closing. But anyway, I'm doing Tower of Babel. And I'm not doing any Tower of Babel. One, I'm doing it solo. Two, I'm doing it with alternative lyrics that I wrote out of boredom d during my shift one night. And since I'm obsessed with Greek mythology and most mythologies as well, I am doing it with the disciples as deities from the Olympian Pantheon. So we're going to see how this works. This is my third or fourth time trying to record this. So we're going to... We're going to... Pray to Zeus and hope that this freaking works. So, here we go. Wish me luck, all. <laughs> Wherefore, O men of Athens, you shall be wise. Therefore, as long as you stand, I shall open your eyes. Wisdom shall guide you in every way. Wisdom will command every word that you say. Wisdom abound for the rest of your days. This above all, never fall for their lies. Thievery is normally observed to be a misdemeanor. I, however, find it to be quite effective, though it seems to be that I'm alone when I promote the notion that the world belongs to those who haven't sent him. But they have closed off their minds. They seem to find me offensive. Not that I will ever heed their words. I'm far too busy stealing some perspective. Gods of plenty bend mortals to their will. I, however, can help them get their fill. For when I look on humanity and witness all their vanity that stems from the insanity that comes with life, I cannot help but reason that with every passing season, a man who finds himself at peace on average feels no strife. That was almost English. On average feels no strife. Uh, here we go. Family is harmony, music is divine, that's inevitable. The rise and fall, the home above all, the strength of the husband, a mother's warm embrace. Crescendo and vibrato, treble, trumpet, stabs and bass. We should therefore be surprised that some refuse to simply open their eyes. That chords are only strong, the home will be strong so long. Nothing is as sweet as fruit of the vine. Love is like an animal that cannot be tamed or detained. It is an instinct. A natural function, the thrill of the chase is the glory of any hunt. There is not a force on earth or heaven that comes close to love, for there is no way you can diffuse it. The thrill of the chase is the glory of any hunt. Babble, 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 
Babble, babble, babble, babble high above the rabble. Rabble, 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 babble, babble, rabble, babble, rabble, babble, greatest mind of history. Solving life's sweet mysteries. So listen to me, so listen to me. Know how life should be, know how life should be. Oh, what does it matter if they don't agree? Wherefore, O men of Athens, you shall be wise. But they have closed up their minds. For when I look on humanity and witness all their vanity that stops from the insanity that comes with life, the cords are so strong, the home will be strong so long. Nothing. It is an instinct. A natural function, the thrill of the taste is the glory of any hunt. There is no thirst on earth or heaven that comes close to love for. There is often, even if I have to die many times. We reverted to the original at the end there, and I just got plain confused. But you know what? I'm calling it a success because I got most of the first part, so suck it. Ah! <laughs> that was a clusterfuck and a half, but you know what? I'm calling it a win because I've tried to record this like three times and the next one will be better. I promise. But yeah, so that was my original oh, att attempt at an original take on Tower of Babel from Godspell by Stephen Schwartz. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this I don't even have words. I have no words. Hopefully you enjoyed this experiment as much as I panicked throughout it. So if you enjoyed it, please feel free to, and even if you didn't enjoy it, maybe next time will be better and you'll enjoy that. So please leave a like, uh, subscribe, leave a comment, favorite it, share it, tell your friends, tell your teacher, tell your doctor while he's checking your nads for lumps. Uh, yeah. Hopefully you guys will like it, and uh, feel free to check me out on Facebook, and feel free to check out my whew, theater troupe on Facebook. I have been very active today, very, very, very active. I've had a lot of caffeine, because I get free caffeine, free soda at work, free caffeine. Aww. Um, moral of the story, don't work at Applebee's, because you'll become addicted to soda and caffeine in general. Yeah, hopefully you enjoyed that. And my 3.09, 3.10 a.m. rambling. Uh, yeah, I will see you next time. Hopefully I didn't waste too much of your time, and hopefully you enjoyed some of it. Uh, yeah, thanks a bunch, everyone, and I will see you next time.